our rival fraternity, Gamma Chi, lives across the street from us. We hate those fuckers! I mean, I would rather live next to a house-sized pile of dick cheese than those squids. Eat Titleist, you squid fucks! Nice shot, sir. Shut up! Oh no, yo, you suck my balls! Come over here and say that! And they hate us right back. It's a blood feud is what it is. Hey, squid! A real funny assholes! What is that? Is that nectar or something? Bees? <laughs> Fucking beast, Jesus Christ! <laughs> I would rather have my butthole violently prolapsed by a Louisville slugger bat being yanked out of me by a speeding fucking Mack truck Good than, God. than surrender to those fucking shit dicks across the street. It's not surrendering. We can't afford to keep this rivalry going anymore. We've already spent like a thousand dollars on broken windows this semester, and I can't keep asking the alumni for money because they ask questions I don't want to answer. So we've had to take that money out of social fee. That's why our last party's theme was just drink. It was one of our better parties though. Look, as this chapter's revenge liaison and preemptive strike chairman, neither of those are things, I cannot support this capitulation. It's also a liability for us when we fuck with them. It makes the police come around, and then the police ask questions. Questions like, are you aware that shitting in a mailbox is a federal offense? Or, lying is only gonna make it worse, so for the last time, who threw the live possum into their showers? <laughs> That possum was extra pissed because it had rabies, so it hated water. It was a perfectly executed plan. You just wandered in their front door with a possum you had trapped in an empty case of bush, then threw it at some guy while he was showering and jumped out a window. I was like a ghost. My point is, there's only so many times I can tell the police we'll keep our eyes open when they come around asking about things like who kamikaze a Gamma Kai pledge with a drone while he was hanging Christmas lights on their roof. I'm gonna have to go over Greg's head on this one. The fact of the matter is, he doesn't have the balls to win this war. Action requires great men, and great men have great balls. Greg, I don't know what to tell you, man, but I am officially gonna have to go over your head on this one. Please note that in the minutes. You got it. That's not a thing you can do. Stop fucking with Gamma Kai. End of story. <laughs> Greg, we've got some irons in the fire that we can't exactly pull out. Yeah, I can't just stop having the pledges catfish Gamma Kai's entire exec board now, okay? I got an entire catalog of dick pics for blackmail! What is the end game on that? Well, we were gonna have all of them show up to their first face-to-face -face meetings with their girls wearing blue hats, but in a Bloods neighborhood. They get shot in the head. Okay, well that's gonna lead to a murder, so... Exactly. Mm -hmm. That's murder we're involved in. Yeah. I also bought Bear Mace. Please tell me you didn't buy that with house funds. Greg, this rivalry stretches across this chapter's history. Gamma Kai chartered this school in 2002. Sup, bees, you fucking squids. Oh, shit. <laughs> Not again. Where do they keep getting bees? On their crests, it's their clothing car. Hey guys, thanks for watching Exec Board. If you liked it, then go ahead and subscribe to the Total Frat Move YouTube channel. And if five people subscribe right here in the next five seconds, I'll sack tap Greg. There's no way you could possibly. <laughs> <laughs> or I'll just do it anyway. <laughs> yeah, fuck you, Greg. No one likes you. Thanks, guys. <laughs>